Before we get started with this Shopify tutorial, where I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to create and verify a Shopify account right here in Nigeria, let me show you guys four different websites. So if you come to my screen right now, you're going to be seeing this website, the sale. This website sells plants, animal friendly plants and you know, stuff like this, right? Now the second website, which is Ted Crown, sells jewelries like necklaces, pendants, you know, stuff like that. Now the third website, A Mori, sells eyeglasses, you know, customized eyeglasses with these beads and stuff, right? You can see this kind of eyeglasses that Beyonce wears and stuff like that. That's what they sell on this particular website. Now the fourth one, which actually the last one, is this Karen Finch. Now this website sells suits and uh, all these kind of suits, right? Three-piece suits two-piece suits, you know, stuff like this. Now, the interesting thing is that all these websites are actually built with Shopify. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to create and verify a Shopify account right here in Nigeria, right? Now, this is the first part of my dropshipping tutorial, which I'm going to be doing over the next few weeks. I'm going to be dropping videos on dropshipping over the next few weeks. So if you're excited about me showing you exactly how to make money dropshipping with Shopify and other platforms, let me know in the comment section and I will not hesitate to actually hurry those videos up. Now, before we jump right in, if you're seeing me for the first time, my name is Gerald and I make videos around making money online. So what I do is that I try things out the work. I come right here and show you guys exactly what I've done. And the whole idea is that you can do the exact same thing and of course get the exact same result. Now that's it guys, I'm going to go to my laptop screen right now and show you guys exactly how to create and verify a Shopify account right here in Nigeria. Now if you've not done that, I want to encourage you guys to smash the like button on this video, subscribe to my channel and most importantly turn on the bell notification button so that when I drop more amazing videos just like what you're about to watch right now, YouTube is going to send you a notification instantly so on my screen right now and you can see the fact that shopify the basic costed two dollars per month that dollars every single month now the this one cost 92 and this one cost 399 dollars i'm going to be showing you how to get shopify over the next three months for one dollar every month that means you're paying three dollars for the next three months as opposed to paying as high as 399 dollars right and for you to get that all you need to do is to click on the first link in the video description it's going to bring you to this interface where it says start for free then enjoy one dollar per month for next three months right i'm going to show you guys exactly how to do that if you actually find this very interesting let me know in the comments just say thank you gerald you know for this shopify tutorial so what i'm going to do right now is that you're going to click on the first link in the video description it's going to bring you to this interface that you're looking at right now and what you need to do is to put in your email address or in this space that's been provided so i'm going to put in my email address right here right now gerald ford 705 at gmail.com then i'm going to hit start free trial Okay, so it says, let's get started. Which of these best describes you? I'm just getting started. I'm already selling online or in person. So let me, let me go to, I'm just getting started. So this is for beginners basically, right? So I'm going to come here and go to next. Now it says, where would you like to sell? An online store in person, an existing website or blog, social media, online marketplaces, I'm not sure. So an online store, go to next. Now here it says, what do you plan to sell first? Products I buy or make myself, digital products, drop shipping products, services, print on demand products, I will decide later. For this particular series, we are going to be selling drop shipping products. So I'm going to go with drop shipping products. The interesting thing is that you can select more than one digital product, service and coaching and all of that, right? So I'm going to say with this and this, I'm going to go to next right here. Okay. Where will your business be located? I'm going to choose my country, right? And go to next. So it's saying that I should choose a password right now. So let me choose a password. So I'm going to choose a password right here. I'm going to click on create Shopify ID. So it gets me to, okay, it says validating your account. So let's just give it a while. So it says building your store. Okay. Build your list, send emails and automate key and everything. So this is loading up. We're just going to give it a while for this to finish. So because I use that link in my, in my video description, it says your trial just started. Your trial ends on the 16th of June. So to extend your plan, to select a plan to extend your Shopify trial for just $1 per month for the first three months, right? So you can click on select a plan to actually do that. And we're going to be doing that right now because it is very important. So I'm going to come here, click on select a plan. Okay. So you can use either the basic, the Shopify or advanced. You see, instead of paying $24 here or $69 here or $299, you can pay $1 for the next three months, right? So what I'm going to do right now is to come here, choose basic plan. Let's say you want to use the basic plan or you can use this one or this one, whichever is fine. 
So I'm going to come here and say select choose basic plan. This is very important that you do this. So what this means is that in the next three months, you can actually test out Shopify for the next three months for just one dollar to find out if it is for you or not. Right? So I'll encourage you to actually do this. So it says one dollar for the next three months, then take two dollars per month, or yearly one dollar for the next three months, then two hundred eighty dollars for this, right? So I'm going to select this one, one dollar for the next three months. Then I'm going to say confirm billing circle. I'm going to select your country. This is selected by default, right? So my first name, I'm going to put in my first name right here. My last name and my address, postal code, I'm going to leave it alone. Then my phone number, I'm going to put in my phone number right here. Then I'm going to hit save address, right? And my address is going to be saved right now by Shopify, right? So the next thing is payment method. You choose how you want to pay. You want to pay with credit card or you want to pay with PayPal. For most of you, it's most likely to be credit card. So your Nigerian bank card might not work. So if you have a Pioneer card, you know, just like myself, I'm going to be paying my Pioneer card. Or you have a dollar card from GT Bank, um, First Bank or wherever, I can actually use it, right? Or you can straight up go to grid.co and set up a virtual dollar card. This video showing up right here will show you guys exactly how to do that, right? So set up that and can use it to actually make this payment. So put in your card details right here, put in the expiration date right here, the CVV here. And uh, of course, select your name, then hit add credit card. And that's all you need to do. They're not going to be charging your credit card because you have free trial. And after that free trial expires, they're going to be charging you $1 every month for the next three months. So it says here, we won't charge you until your free trial ends on June the 16th, right? For me, it's June 16th. So our account has been created. The next thing is for us to verify our account. So what I'm going to do right now is to come where it says my store admin. Click on manage account, right? So this is very important. And it says verification email sent to my email address. So you can hit on resend verification email. So you need to go to your email and actually verify your email address for Shopify. Very important. So this is the email from Shopify. So I'm going to hit confirm email right here. And this is going to verify our email address. Beautiful. So it says your email has been verified. So let's come back here to um, refresh this. So this is supposed to disappear right now because we have verified this email address. Okay. So it says I should log, log back in to confirm. So I'm going to uh, put in my email address here. I hit continue with email. Okay. So I'm going to hit login now. Put in my password and hit login. And it's going to log me back in. You see that very email application has disappeared. So you can upload your photo. Put in your first name, your last name right here. Can update your email address add your phone number right here it is optional but you can actually do that and uh yeah i think we are done with this so i'm gonna hit save right here okay so we are done with this so i'm gonna come back to the home page right here right and the next thing there are seven other tasks for us to complete which is adding your first product finding product to sell managing your services customizing your online store adding a custom domain name naming your store and setting up email provider so that people can actually pay you and you can collect your payment with this payment provider right here with Shopify. And also with Shopify, you can monitor your orders right here, view your products, your customers, the contents of your website. But of course, the analytics, you know, see what's, what's going on behind the back end of your website, everything. Marketing where you can run ads and all of those things. You can actually do that from here. You can also offer discounts and you can also select your sales channel, your point of sale and your online store. And of course, you can add apps, you know, dropshipping apps that you can actually link AliExpress automatically into your, to your Shopify account and mark up the price. So when people come there and actually buy something from you, AliExpress will actually ship the order to them directly. So you don't even need to see or touch those products. It's an automated process. If you want to see all of that, let me know in the comment section. That will most likely be my next video, guys. So until I I see you in my next video. Keep winning and don't forget that Gerald does love you guys. Bye from here, guys.